yeah. for like an evening moment. And can we just? <gasps> oh no! I love it. I, I love am it, I now love it, I love part it. of the club as well. Oh, the tiny bird. Welcome, <laughs> welcome. So today actually marks the first episode of a new series and I can't wait to share it with you because it actually involves all of you guys and I will tell you later why. First of all, we have Patricia behind the camera today. Hi, Hi guys! <laughs> and we are at somebody's place today. I'm gonna show you now what we are going to do. Let's see where we are first, right? Come, come, come. <laughs> Hello! Oh, hi. Ooh, who's that? So nice to see you. <laughs> so nice to see you again, Cassie. Welcome to my collection. It is incredible. So actually, the new series I'm going to do is called Handbag Stories. Mm -hmm. And we're going to start with you, of course. You know, I wanted to have like a boom start. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this collection, you know, needs to be seen. <laughs> and um, yeah, so what I'm going to do actually mm -hmm. is I hope that all of you will want to join in. If you live in the UK, you can text me, you can write me, you can send me an email and you can say, hey, Omina, I've got an amazing collection as well. And then I might actually come to you. <laughs> So that's the plan. I would say mm -hmm. let's just look at your collection a little yes, bit more. Yes, yes. And Patricia, what's your first impression? Wow. <laughs> that's all I have to say. This okay. is years of yeah. being a luxury addict. Exactly. Um, starting from, oh gosh, my <laughs> oldest bag, which is back here. That's what I wanted to say. Which one's your first, Cassie? The okay, first. so we're first. going to have to, look, we're in London, right? <laughs> so we've not got all the space in the world. So we've True. got to put things behind things and whatever, <laughs> right? So... I will have to say, you're going to be so, like, the condition of this, because I folded it, I folded it. But here she is, because if this bag is one thing, she is durable, and she can be folded and then look. Amazing. There we go. I you believe have it was, lift with her. That's I know, look at the colour of the patina and everything, which is so beautiful. Just like... The new look at that. <laughs> it's aged it's aged, it's aged very well really right and i know that people give the never full a bad name including myself but um, there's a reason why everybody loves it i always yes. say that they are so comfortable yes exactly exactly and do you want to know what as a first bag for the age that i was and everything else i yeah. used this yeah. so much yeah. and you know it's a throw in and go live your best <laughs> exactly. life tell me first of all yes. how many bags do we have in this room how many bags do you currently own? Do you know it? Have you ever got it? Probably, I think we've maybe got like 34, wow. something okay. like that. Okay. Yeah, I think yeah, I have yeah. like around 34. Yes, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, that was your person that I had mm -hmm. back. Amazing. Is that your best travel companion as well? Would you say no. so? This one. This one. This is my this is my new travel uh, bestie. And actually, inside, I got a bag organizer that I think is actually for the um, Dior book tote. Oh. But everything is ready to go. Wow. Right. So this is the first time now I see her in person. It, it's, it's, it's yeah, really nice. exactly. And it I is. just love like. It's easy. You yeah, throw it in. You put exactly, it on the top of your exactly, roll-on, and off you go. Exactly. You know. And I love that the colours are a bit interesting. Yeah. We know the GG Supreme print in the normal brown, and the green just you know something a little Pops. bit different. <laughs> exactly. Um, so yeah, yeah, she does the job. Yeah. Let me tell you. Let me ask you the mm -hmm. most difficult question first. Which one's your favourite and why? Stop. We no, can't. I know. I know. I know. We cannot pick favourites, but we have to. <laughs> Okay, I mean, there's one that's very obvious. Let's let's make sure that all the other bags don't hear it. <laughs> yes. Close your eyes, plug your ears. Um, it would probably, I mean... Yeah, I think it's got to be. Would you say that's your prized possession? <sighs> she is the crown jewel okay. in my She's collection. She, she has to be. I mean, purely just because of all the rigmarole to get yeah. and the hype and everything else. Let me you ask know? you something, Patricia. Do you know the name of this bag? All I know, it matches your makeup at the moment, oh, so. Thank you, thank you. It's like I planned it. Um, yes, yeah, so purely because of the hype and everything surrounding this bag and how, like, hard it would Do be to replace it. This, baby? With the little twillies? I know. Aww. I know. She's, oh, looking, God, she's looking very cute. Very, very beautiful. That's 25, right? Yes. That's such, a, such a rare size as well. Okay, what do you mm -hmm. say? Bags still don't listen, please. Any regrets? Oh, okay. 
Can a regret be a gift? Yes, of course, of course, of course. Of course. Okay. So this lives in here and hardly ever sees. Oh, very it. hidden. Day of One hundred percent. So I, I, and do you want to know what? I think my mum would agree. My mum bought me this for a birthday. <laughs> the oh MCM gosh. robot bag. I, I mean, I love the iridescent oil slick kind that, of look that's, of the that's, that's, that's the only like good me. thing it's got going for it. It really is. Also and goes well with your makeup today. <laughs> there we go. We've got to give it something. I actually think like the structure of it is pretty easy to use and everything, but it's just like this horrible little robot. Mm. Why? Why? Mm. You know? I mean, without yeah. the robot, it would have been yeah. alright. Well, how old were you when you got this? You know what? It mm -hmm. wasn't that long ago. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think I was maybe like 24. So, um, exactly. If I was like early 20s, late teens. Yeah, late teens, I'd, I would say that's I mean, amazing. exactly. Every, that would have been, I, I would have been over the moon. But exactly. uh, I've personally moved on from this. So, I, I would probably say that this is uh, this the disappointment of the family. Yes, yes. Okay, let's have a look at what other pieces we have in here. I yes. Think. I see some clutches. Yes. So these are things Ooh. that are mainly like for occasions, you yeah. know. Yeah, they don't really get used too much. But yes, yeah, so that's yeah. Lulu Guinness. And then I love Alexander this McQueen. One. Yeah. This is Python. Yes. Wow. I've never seen you wear this on any pictures. I, I, again, yeah. it's because like I feel like I need a ball gown uh, or something, you know? Yeah. Um, okay, yeah, let's hide this one. Let's yeah, hide yeah, this yeah. one. <laughs> okay, would you say you have a bag that's like the diva of your collection that steers the ship? I mean, <laughs> she right in is, the middle. <laughs> she is an attention seeker. She wants all Maybe the spotlight. Maybe take it out. Let's her. try and get it with the light. I mean, yeah, need to really see it. I mean, this is such a gorgeous piece. Wow. Yeah. And what I love about this is that it's. It's a very casual bag style, right? We know the, the nylon versions and everything. And I, I just love the fact that this can still be styled so casually. Mm. And I think a lot of people are scared to do yeah, that exactly. because it's crystals and they think, oh, this is only for evening, you know? True, true. But if you do just wear it with jeans, what a moment. What yeah. a pizzazz. It's so... What do you think? Yeah. Patricia, is Thoughts? there something for you? Sparkly. I actually Sparkly. like these ones. Oh, I'm glad. I'm a they fan. come in like a beige and a pink as well, I think, right? But uh, I think this yes. is like the classic. I know, I know. Oh, I just... And the thing is, is that the cameras don't do it justice. Yeah, like, it's pictures true. Like pictures or whatever. Yeah. I always say that when I film my vlogs, I'm like, yeah. it doesn't come across properly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> in real life. Exactly. So, yeah, this is the diva, 100%. Yeah. Your best everyday bag. Oh gosh. Um, what am I doing? Am I running errands? Am I running yeah, around? Yeah. Run around London. Do you want to know what? <laughs> this is a very uh, recent purchase, mm -hmm. but for errands, you throw everything in her. Yeah, and you don't need to worry about it, right? No. Even it's though it's grey, so... would you say you don't worry about colour transfer because of the canvas? Uh, no, I don't know what it is, um, but she's just very durable and quite roomy. Yeah. And it's still quite a small, compact bag. Mm -hmm. I don't know how they've managed to do it, but they've done it really well. Yeah. So if I'm running around town, like, I've got things to do, I've got to go to the post office, all of this business, this is a good one mm -hmm. to have. Amazing. What about your best bag for, like, evenings out in London? What would you choose? It's got to be a tiny oh, We're going to talk about tiny, tiny bags yes. anyway, because guys, Cassie is the queen of <laughs> tiny bags. <laughs> tiny bags, tiny bag energy. I love, love, love them. I would say that this one is currently um, my go-to yeah. for like an evening moment. And can we just... <gasps> Now part of the club as well, oh, the tiny bag. Welcome, <laughs> welcome. Oh my gosh. So this Stop. is my newest edition and I thought I have to show you this because you're the queen of tiny bags. I love it. And this is the cabochon. That, this that, is the that, cabochon, yeah. exactly. <gasps> Oh my god! I, I thought you would like it, right? Stop. I am obsessed. <laughs> and you can wear crossbody. It's amazing. It's <laughs> it's Next so purchase. Cute. I know. <laughs> Stop. And this is so, so you as well. The gold exactly and right. everything. Gold and gold. This is this is the perfect introduction to tiny bag energy for you. Exactly. <laughs> I, I actually can fit a lot of stuff in it. So I was like, it's not that bad, you know? This is cards, keys, masks, Even like, and a lip gloss. Even like, you know, these tiny little brushes, the round brushes that you can fold? Oh, yes, it yes. It's oh, amazing, guys. There you so go. I can only what more do you this. need? What more do you need? <laughs> exactly. So, so again, cute. let's go back to your okay. tiny bags, of course. <laughs> 
So that mm-hmm. is, let's get a close up shot of this. That is so, 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 so cute. And of course, please tell us more about this one. <laughs> My favorite. Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> you said so. I wanted it immediately. This one is essentially a joke. <laughs> this is the Petit uh, Chiquito. Can I see this? Yes, please. Yeah, there she is. <laughs> I mean, she let's, will let's get a full body. Like, yeah. How does this look? Does it look? Does it look like I could go out like this? The thing is, I just love how it is a joke, right? We all know yeah, this yeah, is course, unusable, course. right? And and what always like? Have you tried like, to put like your earpods or something in it? No, yeah, I've tried. No chance. I think it's made for one. It's literally like two tiny little pieces of gum. <laughs> okay. Like, not even the ones that come with a wrapper, because the wrapper's <laughs> taken up too much space. Like, this is, and um, I remember when I did the video for this, mm. people were asking, like, oh, does it fit the, like, um, does it fit a card in or whatever? And I was like, I'm, you're not understanding. Yeah, you're not understanding that. The minutia <laughs> that is this bag. It's made for one penny. Well, just, <laughs> just one single penny. You know when you go to Tesco and you've mm-hmm. got to have a coin to use the trolley? Yeah. That's that's we this the is the home coin for the there. coin. Yeah, that is literally it. But what I love to do mm-hmm. is do this. Have you ever thought about using it as like a back charm? Because I can um, see that like on. That's a good idea, actually. Yeah, and some, somebody else mentioned this to me, mm-hmm. and then I completely forgot. So I may need to. Um, yeah, yeah, have a bit of a go. Have you ever taken it out? Probably not, right? I've I've done it two together, okay, okay, which okay. I love. Okay. Um, but yes, yeah, not by herself. She can't be trusted by herself. Yeah. She's she's yeah. too much of a baby. Okay. Now, yes. I mean, we know this is your prized possession. If you could only keep one, would it be this one then? Oh, but then there's like I know, I know. A... I mean, it's difficult. Am I okay? Is this a situation I need I need Zombie Apocalypse. Zombie Apocalypse. You can only take one and run. <laughs> is there a possibility that like I'll be able to build up my collection again? Or Hopefully. is this like this is it for the rest of your life? I mean let's 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 be optimistic. <laughs> oh, it'll probably have to be her. Yeah. You know what? Because it's like zombie apocalypse, worst thing in the world, I sell it. Mm-hmm. You know? What about surviving the zombie apocalypse? Right, absolutely not. Okay. <laughs> right, survival, we need your ability. Uh-huh. We need, could be the never fall, to be it honest be with you. Fall. Because that thing, Grab you, and run. you can drag it through mud, you can <laughs> run over it in a tractor, it's going to look exactly the <laughs> same <laughs> after. <laughs> Honestly, zombie apocalypse, yep. we're off. We're off. <laughs> yeah. So um, that's an option. What else? If it wasn't that, that actually. Well, that's going to be a. Uh, yeah, let me tell you. Oh, that's a hard shirt. Yes, <laughs> and if you're in a bit of a tight situation with, with a zombie over the head, right? That's gonna that's gonna do some damage. I I I want to sleep, so let me yeah, sleep. go for oh, it. It's heavy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and yeah. have a look inside because the organisation of it is mm. the best bit. Amazing. There's yeah. So many card slots as well. I know. Yeah, I could see that. That would be probably helpful over in terms the chest. Of surviving. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> you never know. You never know. <laughs> um, if you were to gift your mom one bag from your collection today, which one would it be? Well, yeah. if you would have return your gift. Okay, it would have to be one that I know that she likes, mm-hmm. and I know that she does not like. Some oh, okay. Bags, okay. So, so tell maybe... us, tell us about it. What about the ones that she doesn't like? Yes. I know that she doesn't like this okay. one. Okay, why to bright? And it's again the same she... colour, almost as your beloved. I know. It's not that she thinks that it's like too much of a trend piece, which oh. it definitely is. But it doesn't matter if we love it. You know, yes. I have exactly. my Bottega pieces, and I absolutely love them. Exactly. Just, no matter if the trend dies, let it die. Yeah, exactly. Okay. I'll keep rocking it. You exactly. know. <laughs> and I also think that we. With some pieces, yeah. it moves past the point of a trend, and it's almost like iconic yeah, because definitely. of how you and know. I think like, this chain will be. <laughs> I'm gonna have to. I'm biased, but I think so. Yeah. So, Patricia, any 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 comments from somebody who doesn't know anything about bags? Well, I definitely know this one because it's been everywhere on Instagram. <laughs> I love it, mm-hmm. but I'm turn torn because it it is very trendy. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Um, so, do you want to know what actually? If I could gift my mum one, mm-hmm. it would be this. Because she loves an easy throw in. She loves the uh, like yeah. little yeah. low AV basket bag, okay. those kinds of yeah. things. So yeah, I would probably gift her that one, yeah. Let's talk about Chanel. Yes, let's. And the quality issues that <laughs> arise more and more, right? Yes. <laughs> so luckily, we have had the chance to collect our bags over a certain amount of years, right? Yes. So our bags are still like good quality. We check them when we buy them. Mm-hmm. 
what's your most favorite like Chanel bag that you have? That one. And I would say, is it the most durable as well from your collection? Probably. It's actually caviar leather. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get into um, Because the other ones are hidden in the back. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. This is so, the contrast is so gorgeous. Oh my God, I didn't you know. Yes. It had the blue details. This was a bag that I saw on the runway and I was like, immediately fell in love. I'm a blue person. Mm. I love blue. It's the chain so aspect. Like, it was just everything. And also... I love the canvas strap because yeah. it makes it a little bit more casual, you yeah. know? Um, it's just delicious. And you to could me. probably attach, oh no, is it attachable? Oh, no. no. It's okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, they should have done that, actually. They have that, done that. Yeah, that would have been a good idea. But, this is beautiful. and then actually, again, it's yeah. quite a roomy situation. It is. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah, so do you have, have you ever noticed any flaws? in your Chanel bags or have we been lucky luckily so far I think I think we've been lucky okay. you know what when was your Chanel 19 down there yes 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 Is it take around in? Don't even ask me. I have been right. I have been back and forth as to what leather this is yeah. because I can't figure it out. I, my essay at the time told me lambskin, I but then so, yeah. but then the finish of it, I was comparing it to other goatskin. Mm. I was like, I think it's goatskin. Yeah, if but, I see that, I would immediately say it's goatskin. Also, okay, it doesn't feel like lambskin. Yeah, yeah, at all. So I have got no idea. And I mean, it looks good. Have you worn it quite often? It yes. Yeah. Yeah. So this is a if it was really lambskin, good. I think we would know by now. No, no, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's true it's true um this is a really good everyday bag mm. great size it's got one of these little um mm -hmm. pillow things stuffing it but great size very easy i mean the style goes with everything mm. you've got that top handle because i've even like worn this to a dinner or something mm. you know because she can do both yeah. you can do a dinner you can do a casual walking around mm. town whatever and it's just so hard wearing i still want one it suits you I know. I really want one because, like, I love my Bottega chain pouch. Yes, and this is, yes. Like, the Chanel version of it. I know. And oh, I think you can dress it up and down as well, right? Definitely, definitely. It's... And it's th this size is the smallest of the. Okay, I'm going now. <laughs> <laughs> it's the smallest of the yeah. um, like that's not a belt bag or a wallet on chain, yeah. and I just think the size is perfect. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. Mm -hmm. What other Chanel beauties have we hidden? So there? we have two slightly older ones. Mm -hmm. So we've got Ooh, this a buy bag. I didn't know you had a buy bag, Cassie. I know, I know. It's a perforated leather one. Yes, yeah, so this mm. was, I think, Cruise 2015. I got my first boy bag in 2015. Oh my, my gosh. first Chanel bag ever, actually. Oh, fantastic. It's the same size. It's just like the yes. plain black. It's lambskin, unfortunately. I didn't know <laughs> I didn't know enough at the time. Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. It is. I um, have the, the um, gold, the brush gold heart. Oh, bag. nice. Yeah, so this one, I think the collection was, was this your first ever Chanel bag? No, this one. Mm, mm. Does a wallet on chain count? Oh, this. Mm, yeah. Okay. Maybe. So, yeah. so this was probably my first ever. Um, and then this one. And I have mm -hmm. such a soft spot for this. It's just a Chanel flat bag, obviously seasonal. Yeah. Again, a little bit of perforation. Yeah. I'm clearly going through a phase. <laughs> Um, and it's this really great blue grey, yes, which yes. matches with a lot, you know, with jeans, with whatever. It's perfect. For and yeah, yeah, it's definitely more of a casual bag. You can see over time it's we've not got a classic, some wearing. Classic flap, right? No, it has no, no. Actually, a zipper fur on the inside. Yeah, interesting. Mm -hmm. Um, silver hardware and all of that. It's still even got mm. the stickers from from however old this is. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I always like, like peel them off immediately. I once read somewhere like if you leave them on, they might scratch because dust particles might get underneath. Oh them. god! Oh god! I don't know. I, I mean, on the inside, it's not that. Bad. <laughs> um, but like, yes, you can see over time, you know, the, the leather has worn and whatever yeah. because obviously this was soft. But I do love this, and it's just such an easy Amazing. and so different. <laughs> So, um, would you say you already own your Holy Grail bag, or is there another Birkin, another Kelly, another, you know, big investment that you want to make at some point? What is your Holy Grail? Do you want to know what's sad about luxury? Mm -hmm. And I think this is life I mean, in general. I think this is, whether it's bags or what, whatever exactly. it is that somebody's passion is, there's always going to be something else. Exactly. Um, so, I don't know if I will ever take everything off. Right mm -hmm. now, if you are to ask me what my Holy Grail is, it would be a special order. 
Oh my gosh, and what's your combination? How do we go there? Oh gosh, <laughs> you so, tell me. Okay, I, <laughs> so my ideal mm -hmm. Birkin would be size 30, gold mm -hmm. hardware, mm -hmm. black box calf leather in yes. terms of the outside, and then a pink rose oh, interior. Yeah. So that is kind of still a classic from afar. Yes. But then if you open it up, it's mm -hmm. like, boom. Yeah, that I love that. Room. That's good. And yours? <laughs> okay, it would either be... Patricia is looking like she doesn't know what we're talking about. She's like... <laughs> um so mine probably 25 or 30 okay, yeah. i would go for epsom mm -hmm. and i would go for the combination that's like this would be a different color so this would be one color yes. and then the, okay. the little yeah. fashion fashion would be another and i think that i would actually do like a black with yellow mm. so, I mean, I, and then the inside be yellow as well i've whatever. recently seen um in a pre lash shop actually mm -hmm. a black one with orange <sighs> Yes, yes. Yeah. you see, something I like that. I think yellow will even pop more. Yeah, mm. because I'd want it that, like, I don't want to, I wouldn't want to go crazy with it because mm. I would have the tendency to be like, we mm. make it the brightest thing in the world. <laughs> um, and then I hate it after like a year, yeah, right? That's, that's it, exactly. Yeah. So I would have to like rein myself in and do like, let's go with a complete neutral but with a pop. Yes. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. My, it's what I do, right? It's just mine is inside. <laughs> yes, exactly. Exactly. Okay. Um, but um, that would be an yeah. absolute dream. Tell me about the next bag on your wish list. Fenny first. Oh, Fenny first. Oh, which size, which colour? The biggest the size. The biggest size, okay. And you know me, it's I'm a tiny bag lover. Yeah. But there is something about the shape of that bag. Carry it's like it under a big your arm. dumpling again. Yeah, exactly. I love but my it's big more. Dumplings. It's it's a bit more structured. Yeah. It honestly feels like I'm carrying a tiny dog. Yeah, I love yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, so I love Colour. that. And also mm -hmm. in the large size, that extra strap is thicker. Oh, okay. And I like that. Okay. Yeah. But I don't. I want it in a fabric. Okay, really? Yeah. Okay. I love the leather ones. Fabric, then, to make sure again that you know when you when it rubs against. Well, so denim. they've got the grey kind of like wool one with the calligraphy, okay. or the beige one. Okay. Either of those, okay. I absolutely love. And um, I love the calligraphy. Oh my gosh! I mean, you know, it just a little looks bit of Karl left there. Exactly. Um, I love the leather ones, but. I would want to go with a pop, but then it's too much mm -hmm. of a pop because it's quite a big bag. Yeah. So I think I would go for the fabric okay. one. Amazing. That's next. Now, very, very difficult question. Um, do you think bag piece exists? No. No. <laughs> okay. I easy. don't think it does. Well, I don't think talk about it. Well, I, I think that you have to be you have to have a certain type of mentality yeah. for bag piece to exist. That's true. I am too We're much. We're hoarders. Of, We're hoarders. I am. I am. I will. I can't turn over. Like, I can't be like, okay, one in, one out policy. Like, no, they all have a story. And they I got them at a exactly certain point in my to life. Tempt us. Oh, I, I mean, know it too well. <laughs> they know it too well. They know it too well. Um, I'm a complete sucker for all of that. So, yeah. yes, I don't think I'll ever achieve that. Have, have you ever wondered where our obsession with bags comes from? You, like this, why is it bags? I know, why like, is it bags? Like, in the world of fashion, you've got clay, you've got jackets, exactly. trousers, shoes, whatever. Exactly. Though I do have a thing with shoes, clearly. I was going to say, <laughs> <laughs> I think there's as many shells of shoes as the bags. <laughs> but bags, it's like they all do the same thing. You know, like with shoes, you're like, right, you definitely mm. need a flat, you definitely need a heel, you need True. like, you know, there's one for each thing. Mm -hmm. And bags a little bit, you can do that day or night. But they all really have the same purpose. Exactly, exactly. But we get such an emotionally like connected. I know, to our back, I right? know. And like, I, what's going on? Why, what wires are loose? And all that? <laughs> I think part of it is because it's something that we use every day or exactly. most days, right? Oh. And you know, it goes with your outfit and everything else. So you become attached with yeah. it. Yeah, it's like our children. Exactly, exactly. As sad as it is, it is. it's true. <laughs> At least we can admit it. Of course, there we of, go. Course, of course, that's true. Um, but yeah, so I've collected my entire life. I've noticed yeah. that when I thought about it, you know. I was like, I started Things. with like my little ponies, you know. I had like 30 of them exactly. in every colour. Exactly. <laughs> no, it's true. And we just graduated exactly. into different... And then I got into Pokemon cards. And ah. then I got into, you know, whatever. My mom mm. said like, yeah, now you've basically achieved the, the most expensive yeah. kind of, you know, addiction. You know what? At least it's not cards. <laughs> yeah, I mean... <laughs> there we go. Could be worse. Can always be worse. <laughs> but yeah, exactly. so you're pretty sure as well then that we still have that obsession when we're 90, right? I think so. Yeah. I think so. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But then but then we'll have the excuse maybe, you know, if we have children or whatever. Exactly. Like, oh, it's, yeah, just, it's for them. It's though, for them. though I still do use that excuse now and I'm childless. <laughs> so um, <laughs> I always see it like in, in my comment section. People say mother, hashtag mother's excuse. And I'm yeah. Like, yeah. 
I love it's it. A good excuse. I love it's it. A good excuse. It's very, that it's is a very good one. Reasonable. I know. Yeah. Well, the thing is, is that so my mum uses that excuse for me. Oh, amazing. But then, of course, I'm also collecting. So yeah, yeah. It, the the grandchildren or the children or whoever are going to have quite the selection at the end of the day. Sure. <laughs> the same here. Have you still focus on this one and those shoes? Please. Yes, yes. I'm clearly going to like. Do you know? Do you know how much I'm a sucker for? I things. know, and I like this. I'm, oh, my I immediately. I am getting it. it. Um, again, risky with a kind of jersey material, you know, but there's something it gives very classic. Have you, have you noticed anything so far? Chanel vibe. Nothing so far, have oh, you? Oh, it looks and like I've been, new. You know, I've, I've not yeah. tried to baby it or whatever. Again, the inside of it is really... We um, took it on our little bubble tour. Yes, bubble we did, we tour. did. <laughs> and again, oh, I've got some leftover gum in there, don't say anything. But um, yeah, it's pretty, it's just yeah. such a... You know, mm. easy. Yeah, and I love it that you can just wear it on the shoulder. Like, exactly. You know, like, and then it's got this little. Oh, let, me, let me try this on. Yeah, go for it. Because oh, I've seen that in purple, guys. In, yes! In, in, in that Harris. is so you. And Stop. I was like, should I get this? Should I get this? Because See? then we can actually twin. Yes, exactly. <laughs> what do we think, Patricia? Nice. I love bright colors. Yeah. <laughs> so everything that's green, not, not yellow. Too, not too Barbie. No. I love it. I love it. I love it. Again, it, and it looks very vintage Chanel. It just looks a lot brighter on the on the phone. On the, on the thing. On the, yeah. 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 It's a little bit yeah, yeah. dulled down. But I'm trying to think of any what, other what stories. Um, hmm, oh, okay. Let's think. talk about this, please. Ah, is so it a people... bag then? Yeah. <laughs> is it a bag though? So many people actually bought this. It's from the home section, right? Yes. Literally yeah. Home section. And they attached a little twenty. A little scarf, and I, then it turned into a bag. Exactly. Have you ever used it as a bag? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. And do you, like, I love this for like a dinner moment. Mm. You know, something like that. Even if you were going to like an event mm. or something, and if your dress goes with it, it's just such a weird and wonderful thing, you know. Um. So I love it for that. But again, everything is on show. Yes. So yeah. you have to be wary. Card wear, case, all of that business, and you know your keys rattling around or whatever. But. It is like cute. It. It's, it's something, cute. you know, it's, it's cute. And it's yeah. a beautiful piece to show. Exactly. You know? And it has dual purpose because it can be looking after your jewellery in the night mm. and then with you in the daytime serving True. a look. Yeah. Um, which this is new, know. right? I've yes. I've seen that recently. Yes, yeah. So this is the last sort of, I think I got that in the wow. in the late summer, yes. Yeah. But again. I love the colours again. My, it pops so. My thing was just like, it's got such like a chunky yeah. handle for such a tiny bag. <laughs> and I just loved that. Um, and you can actually detach it right and yes it yeah and, it, and there's a, and there's a oh. little ch a chain that goes with it as well Amazing. um other honorary mentions yes. we've got this mm -hmm. she's looking a bit worse for wear <laughs> um because well well you got your cost per wear out i guess i did i did <laughs> and there's a little bit of a funny story that goes with this mm. one i was obsessed with this bag i was in uni mm. i was living and breathing. I actually by had this your bag. GM uh, never for in uni. Oh, yes, and I was yes. Also, uh, can you remember, Patricia? I, I do was, remember. Yeah, I, I was carrying. Do you remember the bag? <laughs> um, and I was like, I would have done terrible things for this bag. Mm. And I got myself on some waiting lists around England or whatever, and I wanted this colour. It had oh, to be wow. this colour. Oh, that was waiting list at that time? Yes, wow. I know, okay. crazy. And then I got a phone call. It was like a random Wednesday saying, I got a phone call saying, we have one in. It's in Harvey Nichols in London. Oh, and, and, I was, and I was in, and I was in uni in Birmingham. Oh, and really? I got on that train. <laughs> and I was there, and I was like, yes, just hold it for two hours. I can get there within two hours. Got this bag. My dad to this day still has no idea that I miss lectures to co to collect a bag. Let's hope he's not going to watch this. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yes. Yeah, so you know what? Sometimes you've got to do what you got to do. And actually, I think I was that's obsessed. The only yeah. Bag you've ever been obsessed with? <gasps> yeah. Really? But that it's was, over now. <laughs> no, exactly. Like, it was such a yeah. thing. Like, oh and for God. me, it was this bag, a G wagon. And like a big, <laughs> like a, a dog or a Frenchie, yes. like husky. That, that, that was my... <laughs> that is the vibe. I respect that wholeheartedly. Um, amazing. Oh, which of the... Oh, we haven't, we haven't seen the beautiful... Um, the Dior saddle, saddle bag, bag which I was obsessed with from like when I was 11. Same, same. I saw one in the KDV in Berlin when I was oh like 15. My gosh. I was like, yes. I want that bag. Exactly. And obviously too young. My mum yeah, wasn't going to buy me a saddle bag. No. <laughs> And um, yeah. so now we came around. <laughs> exactly. So then they re-released it and I was like, this yeah. is my time. Exactly. Yeah. So yes, and I went with the original oblique yeah. and everything. Then we have this as sort of its offspring, yeah. 
which is a belt bag version. Is that a green? Yeah. Oh, wow. And they don't do the green anymore. Mm. Um, but it's, yeah. again, such a cute little belt bag. Beautiful. Looks, looks so And, fun. of course, the most hyped bag ever down there. I think people went Oh, my crazy. gosh, of course, of but course. Well. Did yes. you have to be in a waiting list for that? How did you get that Do you want one? to know what? Oh. I seem to have played this game very well. So I <laughs> saw the bag on Instagram. Okay. You know, everybody was Before wearing it. Before it came out? Or? So this was, the influencers were wearing okay. it, okay. but it had yet to be released. Okay. So I was like, I texted my essay and I was like, I need this bag. <laughs> and she was like, okay, come in and uh, make a deposit and then I'll tell you oh, when wow. it comes in. So, but she basically received it in store a few days before it was actually released. Oh, okay. So that's how I got it. Okay. And I was like, oh my gosh. Amazing. And it was such a good price at the time as well. Like yeah. now with price yeah. increases, I think it's close to like 1,300 or something. Oh, really? Yeah. And at the, at 1,050. Yeah. Can't say anything bad about that. Yeah, I know. Really I know. Like the in the grand really scheme of, yeah, that. exactly. So, um, yeah, it's a, again. This is another easy errand bag. You throw it across, yeah. off you go. Have you got a compartment yeah. apartment for everything? Yeah. And it's very kind of like streamlined and close to the body, Amazing. which I like. Yeah, yeah Cassie, that was. Awesome. So, yes. guys, you get the idea of what we're doing here, mm -hmm. right? So, if anybody wants to take part in this new series, please write me. <laughs> yes, no, and no, do. It's so, yeah. it's so fun. And, I found, you like, know? What, what do people love to watch? They love to watch blogs and they love mm. to watch handbag collection videos, yes, right? Yes, And, yes. I mean, I can only do a handbag collection video every year. <laughs> exactly. So, I thought, hey, let's just feature everybody else, you know? Because we all are such a beautiful community. Exactly. All of us have probably so many beautiful bags. So, mm -hmm. if you want to show them, showcase them. And I will, I will feature them. <laughs> so. and, and and we all tend to have a bit of an emotional connection. Exactly. Or the there's stories. a story. Yes, that's there's what a it's story about. behind, Please like, stories. I got this for that and exactly. all of this. So, so yeah, it's that's, always that's, fun to that's share. That's the idea. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, so I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, join our little handbag obsessed family here, because we all do have the same luxury disease. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, guys, we see you again soon, right? Bye. Bye. <laughs>